Hello everyone, and welcome to another video. Good morning everyone, it is currently Tuesday. I was just checking the camera was recording. Um, yeah, it's actually alright today. Apparently there's no rain forecast. There was some yesterday and we did have a bit. Like, it was like one little, a bit of droplets and that was it really. Today is none forecast, but you never know, it can change. Um, yeah, there's not a lot going on now. Really, we're basically, it's half term. That's what, that's what it is, I believe, for most schools now. I believe so, I'm not too sure. Sometimes they have, they're different with different schools. They all choose when they go on half term. Anyway, apart from that, yes it is. So basically, uh, not too early, but you know. When you have half term, it's just not too bad. Sometimes it's busy, sometimes it's not. It's just because half term is... I don't know what I did on half term. I think I still... I'm not too sure when I was young, but now I'm older. But I don't know anyway when I was young, it was different. But when I'm, since I got older, over half term, when I had time off from school, like the, the, the holidays, I don't know what I did. I think I still woke up early because I just couldn't sleep. And, it's just not some what I am. Because some people, there's people who are, there's people who are early birds. This is what we call them, which people who are early. There's late risers. Um, and there's some, yeah, there's late risers. I don't wake up early at all. Um, but sometimes the thing is, if you're an early bird, you go to bed, well, not always, but you go to bed every reasonable time. But sometimes, there's something called something called a hardcore night owl, which means they stay up really late at night, which is known as a hardcore night owl. And because they stay up really late at night, um, they uh, they don't sleep. They don't get a lot of sleep, maybe or maybe they do, but they are not an early bird. But that's diff That's in different circumstances. Like someone who's an early bird, which is just, I don't think I am. I don't think I'm. I think I'm in between the early bird and late riser. But the thing is, early birds they wake up, I think it's due to their job or because that's just what they are. They, or they wake up, or if they, if they aren't working, if they're not unemployed but um, retired or something, they, you tend to sleep less apparently when you're older, that's what I've been told, but that might not be true all the time. But the thing is, when you wake up earlier, I would say you have more of the day, it's just, if you wake up in the, like, the wee hours of the morning, like, three or whatever, um, and it's still dark, mostly, then that's still an early riser. That's not, I, don't think that's, I think that's a really early bird. Like, certain places, certain people wake up at a different time. Me, I sleep, I can go, I can try to go to bed early, it don't work. You have a body clock, basically, but my body clock can get me out of bed at any time. Like, when I actually need to get up, I literally, um, make myself get out of bed because if I don't I'll just fall asleep again. Then you don't have to actually get up but that's just because I haven't got uh, five times five days a week which I'm still looking for but it's still not so easy. Because the job that would suit me it's just hard to get because they don't really fly but you know if the job suits me I'll do it but the thing is I'm applying and applying but the thing is they don't really look much. So that's the thing really. But yeah, we'll see how it goes. Surveys, <laughs> things you do like online, it's just mad. Like, I have a lot of things. It's just like online is a lot of things to do. But you know, I've I get bored a lot, which you do understand. I don't really have reading book right now, but I've got something I can read anyway, um, which helps. Uh, I don't really need to read book to be honest, but I need to carry on reading that. I just read it once and I need to read it again. It's not very easy, but it, it's it's hard, but you know, you need to get through it. So, I will try that again. But yeah, we got loads of things going on now. We got a lot going on. We got, what have we got? We've got, hmm, I think, I'm trying to think now. We've got this booster jab coming out. People are due for it. Because, um, 
apparently after six months the uh, thing kind of goes down which for me won't be till later on but the thing is they're doing the older people and then they're gonna what might the booster might go around like the others Like, what they did with the um, original one is they did the uh, main people first and then they went down the ages, but the thing is, the booster could be the same kind of regime. Although, to be honest, I did get mine, and I, many people have, don't want them, but I don't understand, it's up to personal choice really. Um, some governments are thinking that we should have some nutrition brought back and not have it as personal choice but if we do that it's just going to cause an uproar that's the thing the government is trying to avoid any more lockdowns but the thing is the reason the booster is going around is because more cases are popping up even with double vaccinated people maybe but that's because the vaccine stops working after a while so it, I mean, it's gonna, apparently it's going to become like a flu jab where they're going to put it together because every year you have to have a flu jab, really, and it's basically that is going to be the same as that, basically, you have a jab every year. But yeah, that's what happens with some things, because they haven't cured, but they found something that can kind of lessen the effects of it. Anyway, hope you have a wonderful day with you I'm going to get back to my walk, because I'm coming out a bit late today, and uh, yeah, have a wonderful day with you are, and uh, I'll catch another video shortly. And we'll see where we go from there.